heavy police presence and supporters from the opposition patriotic front PF was the situation at the Drug Enforcement Commission where former First Lady Esther Lungu appeared for questioning. <laughs> Upon arrival, Mrs. Lungu, who was accompanied by former President Edgar Lungu, was blocked from entering the DEC premises as she was accompanied by people who had not been cleared. Police later allowed the former First Lady's motorcade into the Commission headquarters where she was questioned in connection with the 15 properties in Lusaka State Lodge which have been seized on suspicion of being proceeds of crime. After about two hours of interrogation, Mrs. Lungu's legal team addressed journalists. We don't expect this to be a witch hunt. We expect them to do a good job as regards this. And we hope that they will certainly do a good job because we have told them our part and we hope it's not a witch hunt where they'll start going place to place to look for something wrong in any way. In any event, there's nothing wrong. So we are happy that we have come and we have settled this matter. And for us, we consider this matter settled. PF supporters and Mrs. Lungu's sympathizers followed her to her residence in Lusaka's Ibex area where PF acting president Given Luinda addressed the media. I would like to thank the former First Lady and His Excellency the President for indulging me when I called upon members of the Patriotic Front who were represented by the women who came to my residence only on Sunday when they came and told me they didn't want to hear that the first lady, former first lady, went to DEC alone. The DEC says it to issue a statement over the matter at an appropriate time. The 15 flats remain seized by the DEC as investigations continue. Mark Zilgone, CNBC News, Lusaka. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, leave a comment, and subscribe.